This particular part is perfect for done in one. Rudy, how are you, I'm buddy? I'm doing well, how are you? Guys, I'm doing well. Welcome back to MTD CNC North America. I am standing in front of a beautiful Mazak Integrex machine. Mazak Integrex, especially Integrex, are one of the most flexible machines that you'll come across. What I like about it is that there's so many processes that we do individually, machine to machine, five, six, seven processes, where an Integrex machine can reduce those down to mostly one, and if not, definitely drastically reduce it down overall. So Rudy, let's talk about this part that's in front of us and how right. you guys are utilizing the six axis capability of this Integrex machine and making this work. Well, you're absolutely right. The Integrex is the machine of choice when you want to get down to done in one. Most shops have multiple vehicles, multiple lathes, and they move apart from machine to machine to machine, and it works great, but there's a lot of movement, a lot of inefficiency, a lot of chance for error. What we've done with the Integrex is use all those axes to try and complete this particular part in one operation. So when we're looking at this part here, we work with a lot of customers that go, well, I have, I've done this this way on purpose because I'm gonna line it up here, and then I'm gonna line it up here. I know exactly where I'm gonna be. Right. But doesn't it just make more sense to do it in one place without having to move it at all? It sure does. When you have uh, both spindles that engage and become axes, and they can time themselves to each other within two arc seconds, you have much more, much more higher tolerance capability than moving it from one place to another. With every move, there's spindle downtime. With every move, there's operation possibility for Absolutely. error. Absolutely, there's work in progress. These are the things we're trying to reduce. So for the customers out there, for the people watching right now who go, man, I love Mazak, but tell me more about the Integrex itself. What makes this head, this body, these two spindles a bit more unique than a standard lathe or mill that's out there right now? Right. Well, Mazak was the first to introduce the Integrex technology back in the late 70s. Um, they came out with the first slanter. What we've done is basically take all the live tools and basically get that horizontal milling head or vertical machining center milling head and put it on an actual turning head. So this particular machine has a, a, a perfectly milling live holder spindle, okay? So it's something you would see on any kind of a vertical machining center. It's now on the, on the lathe. We've also added a lower turret, which handles all this pinch turning, but also can handle, because of its rotation, it can handle tail stocks or steady rests or any kind of custom fixtures for supporting a particular part. And this also has spindles that can synchronize, come together, and transfer apart. No, no better way. So now that we know how that works for the audience that didn't already, and we have this part in here, mm. it's going to be able to rotate all directions. The head's going to be able to rotate as well. But you guys actually got creative with this piece here. What does this do? Well, what this does is actually it works as a female steady rest. So with this particular part, there's a small tab on the end, which makes it very difficult once it's been machined off to put a center in. So if that part is sticking out, I have no way to support that part when I machine it, after I machine that tab. I don't really want to machine it last, unsupported. So what I can do is use our lower turret and create a small tool that basically supports the part as a female center wrapping around the outside of it and yet exposing the part for milling function. Because the turret is a, is a servo motor, I can, I can uh, uh, put some pressure on it and support that part while I'm machining it. And with the turret the way it is, I can use that same tool in this direction and in this direction. And here in Southern California at Mazak, this is a turnkey operation where you're helping your customer out, you're proving it, they get the machine finished, and when it hits the floor, they're making parts. That's correct. Here at the Mazak Technology Center, we have a full team of manufacturing engineers that turnkey a lot of parts for a lot of different customers. So once the machine is here and finished, we ship it to the customer, they're ready to go. So when I'm thinking about this, is it really, is this too, one of those too good to be true kind of things because I want it to be true, but it really is. When I'm done, I can put that in a shipping box and it's ready to go. It's just, That's not, a, correct. It's just not a statement. This particular part is perfect for done in one.